will first see the amazing operation of this motorboard. As the air is pushed to the back, the motorboard is propelled forwards. Now to make this motorboard, we require a toy motor, a, one, a 3 volt battery pack, a plastic toy fan, tape and a bit of thermocol or styrofoam. Now mark out the outline of a board on a piece of styrofoam with a marker and then cut it with a pen knife. This will make the floating boat. Now this is the boat. Stick another slightly a thicker piece. This is the double tape and with the help of a double tape you stick another small platform onto the boat. It is on this platform that the put another layer of double tape. It has got glue on both the sides and this another piece of strip of double sided tape. Now this is a 3 voltage, uh, 3 volt DC battery pack attached to a small toy motor and a propeller. As you put the switch on, the motor spins very fast. See it spin and stop. Now stick the motor part so that the fan is directed towards the back. Also stick the battery pack on the front. Now the motorboat is ready for its maiden launch. If you switch it on, the fan spins very fast and of course the boat will vibrate because it's kept on a table. Put the switch off and now place it in a tub of water and put the switch on. As the air is thrown to the back, it propels the boat forward. This is, uh, it, this is the verification of Newton's third law of motion that every action has an equal and opposite reaction. It's a very amazing toy and even a more wonderful science experiment. You can have lots of fun playing with this very splendid toy. The boat will go round and round for as long as there is power in the batteries.